and welcome to Arcade Hour. Hope you've grabbed your coilers. Just this head, not headset, head just the um, webcam. We are ready. It's been a bit of a long day, but we are ready to grab our quarters and head into the arcade. So I've decided, as part of our different themed live streams, a bit like how we had Breakfast Club over Easter, I was inspired from last week's Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, where we played through the whole game. A big shout out to Kratia, who helped me through that as well. We played the whole of Teenage Mutant Ninja, Ninja Turtles Shredder's Revenge, and that gave me the idea for Arcade Hour, where we'll do an hour slot um, we're just doing it once this week, but in future weeks we might do it multiple days for the week. We will have our usual other themed live streams as well, uh, but I just want to add this into the rotation. So if you're into arcade style games and you'd like to join in, grab your quarters and head on in. Today's game is Scott Pilgrim vs. The World, the, I'm going to call it the 10 year anniversary celebration that Ubisoft re released. This is the Xbox One version, so if you're on Xbox One, or Series S and X, feel free to join in and just let me know. So I'm going to click Network Game. I'm not quite sure how the multiplayer, online multiplayer works here. Teenage Mutant Ninja Mutant. I'm just going to call Shredder's Revenge. Shredder's Revenge was really good because you can just have a party room code and people can join in. So let's give this a whirl. So if you just want to join in, just let us know in the chat. Um, yeah, up to four players. We'll keep it private for now and then hopefully we can swap it after. We can invite some people in. Um, I'm just going to pin a message here in the chat. Also, let me know how the game audio and I'm sounding. I need a bit louder, a bit quieter. Um, Hi. Um, we are. Bang. Scott Pilgrim. And you would like to join in? Just or let us know in chat. And I'll just make sure I've got brackets. Okay. And then we can pin that, and that means. Anyone joining our stream, doesn't matter what time it is, will know all about it. So yeah, welcome. I'm Panda as well, just in case I forgot to mention that. I'm a variety streamer. We stream lots of things here, new and old. I'm going to go as Ramona. She's the one I've leveled up the most. Um, let's see how we get. And do we invite other people? I assume I just invite them like the friends thing. Okay, there's no way to change... Okay, right, we'll have 15 minutes, and if... Oh no, why did my battery die right now? I've got batteries, spare batteries, sorry. Um, if no one joins in the first 15 minutes, we'll just swap it to public and see if we can get some random people to join in. There we go, I don't know why the batteries decided to die right now, but hey, that's how it goes sometimes. Okay, we'll just have to begin to show people. Ah, this is where we invite some people. Oh, we can't start without other people. But oh, that's a bit weird. Well, let's do a public game then. Great match. Let's tap public. Four people. Ah, you gotta wait. Okay. Cancel that. You know what we're gonna do? We'll do story mode, and if anyone wants to join in, we'll swap over to network mode, and we'll invite you in. Not quite as smooth as I was hoping, but hey. Tittles, Shredder's Revenge so far has got the best out of us. I'm just gonna take this jacket off because I am warm. Um, any questions, feel free to ask. Oh, let's usually just have nice, chilled streams. Right, let's do this. So 
But yeah, if anyone wants to join, let me know any point because we can just easily swap over to the network mode. But yeah, it's a bit silly to do the public thing where it's like you've just got to wait for people to join. It should be like an arcade game where people can join at any time. But yeah, if you need more gameplay audio at any point, let me know. Quiet on my end. My headphones are plugged in properly. Oh, just my OBS has been down. That's better. Take that. I drop this. Oh, oh yeah, okay. I want this baseball bat. Oh, pick it up, that's one. Oh, oh no. A bit of an air jump there. Down he goes. Oh! Anything inside this? Oh, just a skull. Yep, that's it. Hit one bully with another bully. <laughs> Definitely looking forward to the new anime they're making as well. Should be good. 
the voice cast from the movie as well. Yeah, I think Shredder's Revenge was like the best of these arcade types from jumping in. Um, if anyone's got any suggestions on ones you want to see in future episodes, let me know on any of my uh, our social network pages. Got plans hopefully to do the X-Men arcade game. I've got that on the Xbox 360. And we've got Original Turtles. I think which other ones I've got as well. Finish this and then we'll be carrying on. But like I said, if anyone wants to join in, now's the time. Always enjoy this awesome music if you're just watching. Hopefully we're coming to the hyperspace thing. Let's see if there's anything good in here. Okay, just the back. Oh, oh no! Angry dogs. Then we could do a shop to buy some more lives. hyperspace area around here. Get some more money. Oh, well, we just need to find a shop because I have got enough money. Oh.
try and get the block a bit more. I thought that was a hyperspacing. Oh, it is. Oh, subspace, sorry. That's what I mean. Pay us late, please. Yeah, yeah let's go for an ice last thing. Let's go for an espresso over here. No one hit me then. Hey, Maggie Pop, how's he, how are you going? Uh, how are you doing? Oh, tongue twister there. We are doing some Scott Pilgrim. This is the world. This is the 10th year anniversary edition, I think I would call it there. Oh, fair enough, at least you get some awesome music to listen to as you work, because this soundtrack is amazing. All the music's by a chiptune band, and I can't pronounce the name because it's a very long name. I think it's Anaguchi or something. We're just starting off here. The first level should begin to the first boyfriend to defeat in a minute. And part of our arcade hour means. You lovely viewers out there can join in if you want as well. It's up to four players in this one. No, that's fair enough. Well, enjoy the tunes and enjoy Ramona being the living daylights into all these street thugs in Canada. Oh, 
I've never been in that secret door. What have we got here? Beast that grants an extra life. Food of the gods. Upgrades to normal strength. Classic role playing video game. Blast through seven zones at high speed. Um, let's go for an extra life. Ah, I haven't got anything else, enough for anything else. Man, I could afford that, bro. I don't know what that does. Also, when did Ambrosia become food of the gods? Oh, watch out for the traffic. Have you played any LOL? Have you ever played any LOL? Are we talking League of Legends? Or are you lolling? I would. And also, hello, so so, so smelly. How are you doing? Oh, I've got a new move. Ah, oh, lolling LOL. I have played a little bit of League of Legends, so. Only a tiny bit. What was the question? Have you ever played any? Ah. Have I hit this person enough yet? I got some more. You got any more money for me? Nope. I got a guy with a spade walked away like, nope, I don't want to get beaten up now. Well, it is your turn. Right, we've got- oh! Oh, I've got to find this evil boyfriend somewhere. Yep, oh, okay. Once I'm not getting beaten up, I will have a look at- You comment! Out of the way, people! I'm not to. Oh, come on. Oh, what? Oh, what was the name of the documentary? I saw one on. Did I get it on Steam? Or did I see it on Netflix? There was one on Netflix, I think. But it was about the tournaments. I don't think it was about the founding. But those the tournament things are massive. Between that and Dota 2. Which I've watched some bits on as well. Come on. Right. Go and find this evil X to the feet. Got my shovel. Okay, right, I have to check it out at some point. There's some very good video game documentaries on Noclip as well on YouTube. Daniel Dwyer. Beyond GameSpot and Giant Bomb. He's got some very good Patreon funded um, documentaries. The one about. I think there's a Witcher 3 one. I watched the Final Fantasy 14 documentary. There's a bunch of other ones as well. There's one on Hades, Half Life. Um, oh, what are the other games? Anyway, it's definitely worth checking out. No clip. Yeah, they're all, they're all good, the ones on no clip. Even if it's a game that you haven't really played. I find them interesting. Oh, Roller Coaster Tycoon was another one he did. Very good high production documentaries as well. Oh, here we go. First Evil X to defeat.
think they'll make a new one, but there's quite a few other alternative ones as well, and I lose track of the names. I think it's like Coaster World and stuff. Oh. I better focus first. Coaster World. I imagine Toaster World though. There is that game where you play as bread called Iron Bread. And you have to try and get the bread into the toaster. That's a game I'd recommend. I even did a short clip where you do... Toast has like... These little jetpacks or something, it's like a spaceship. Ah. I'm not going to survive very long on this one. One weird bat woman. Come on. Nice, okay. Oh, flashing, we all know what flashing means. Get up, Ramona. Come on. No, 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 no. Ah. I blame things are paying them. Oh, continue. Are oh, you gotta be joking? Okay, let's go back to the map. How was I press continue? How was there not a checkpoint for? Well, we'll just skip that boss thing because we're not going all the way back to it. Oh yeah, this was halfway through. Okay. I don't know why it sent me back all the way there. Alright, save money up and then we find that shop again we'll get some extra lives. Like I said, if anyone wants to join at any point, let me know. We're on the Xbox One version. I'll just backwards travel so you can be on the Series S or X as well. We're currently playing on the Series X. Like so, any suggestions to other arcade hours? Let us know. So far, I've got original Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles arcade, the '89 one, um, the X Men one. I've definitely got on the 360 X Men arcade. Probably got some other in there. Uh, we'll do some. We can also do some games that aren't necessarily from the arcade, but arcade style like this. So, like, do Castle Crashes. 
the remastered version of that. And even to some degree, like fighting games like Tekken and Street Fighter kind of fit into the arcade mold, so. But I'm always going to try and choose something that has like multiplayer where people can join in. Grab it, some brother. Okay. Umbrella rage here. Another 50, we can pick up another life. I don't think we're going to drop that much money, but. That money. I'm just leaving that guy over there to walk by himself. Was gonna try and mess with me. Oh, ah. where did all these bad guys come from? Grab that money. Dog had a lot of money on it. Oh yeah, check out all that money. It's gonna be much use to me yet till we get to the next level. 
I'm hoping with these extra lives, we'll, we'll be in a better state to take on the first Evil X. Like I said, in this game, in the Xbox 360 version, anyway, we'd get to the last boss fight, but never managed to defeat the last one. Okay, here we go. Flashing the boys again. Oh. If anyone wants to join us, this is the chance to get on in. After this level would be a good time. I'm not sure why Ramona has to jump forward every time she's done. Oh, here we go. Good spot. Nice. These from fireballs again. Dang. But he hasn't summoned them yet. Got pinned in this corner, come on. Ah, I'm Right, let's get rid of them because they take. Take a bunch of health off. Might be safe here, actually. Right, one down. Look, that fireball can't reach me. Ooh. Yes. That wasn't too bad this time. Unlucky last time. I got enough money for an extra life as well. Area cleared. Right, if anyone wants to join us for the next level, let us know. We can head into network mode, otherwise, we're going to continue on. On Evil X now. And we're off to Casa Lomas film set. Oh, I forgot to see, of course. Always a pain, aren't they? Two aliens, but with zips were on their heads. Oh, 
That was a dinosaur. What movie is this? Okay, new move. Next play. Next play together or? Street Fighter style here. Nice. Oh, yeah, for those who are a little bit younger, might have not played Street Fighter 2. There are sections where you just get a certain time limit to try and beat the hell out of a car. Right seat needs to go away. Oh no. Let's jump across there. Nice. movie they're referencing here. <laughs> yeah, back up to oh, no, is an angry <laughs> Oh. Makes a lot of angry dinosaur. They dropped health a bit more in this game. Oh. Okay. You're running off? Yep, of course. Ah. Oh. Mad ones. There's a block, but I don't find it works particularly well. Maybe I just need to get the hang of it a bit better.
Uh, I can't be able to jump over there. Making time across just a little bit. Just a line there. Right, I'm trying to look out for any shops. Oh. Right, some type of alien movie, probably. Oh. Oh, No, don't stop me, Papa Rupsy. <sighs> well, I was into that Papa Rupsy. Lives either. Well, this is probably going to go horribly wrong. Let's look at some things. Spawn object. Oh, why? Okay. A B when attacked. No attack. Judo throw. Missile throw. Grapple. Okay. Everything is mainly just Y and X in different directions. I'll try and use that spawn object that does. If anyone wants to join me, this would be a good time to join in. Yes, yes, the main map does have that vibe to it. 
a bit like that in Shredder's Revenge as well. Just have an old school like Pokemon Red and Yellow vibe. Come on. I didn't see any shops in this level to buy more lives. Right, let's try a spawn object thing. Oh, no. I had Pokemon Yellow. Yeah, because there was red and blue, and then Pokemon Yellow came out, which... Ah, there was one bit here. This is near the beginning. And then they released Yellow where Pikachu followed you around. But it was basically the same map. I kind of fell off after that. I think I got Ruby somewhere, but I don't think I've played much of that. And then when they did those Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee, I went for Pikachu. But I enjoyed Legends. I've gone to that. Hopefully make another one of those. I quite like the style of that one. Oh, come on. Am I missing something here? Or do I just need to dodge a bit quicker? an easy way to get the man. There's coins. Right, let's look out for some more shops on the way. Y, old Y, born object. Why is it a oh, like a brick? Okay, That's a bit random. Ah. Maybe I just need to throw objects more at people. For shops, people. I boots into her. Oh. I had some of my special left. with a high attack.
Let's try and break this now, it's not in that way. Okay. Ah, and those coins are all for the pickup. Oh, there's gotta be a shop around here somewhere. This game is definitely a lot tougher than Trailer's Revenge, that's for sure. It's probably one of the situations in four players, probably not as difficult to me. Right, could find a shop we'll be able to get. Some upgrades here. I'll be one somewhere. Get away from me. Get away from me, paparazzi. I hate that paparazzi so much. Crap. I would have been fine if it wasn't for them. Yeah, up here. Come on. Yep. Wow, that is hot. This level is hot. Like one food storm to the beginning, and that's it. to much health. He did indeed. I think the whole cast is great. I'm glad the whole cast, well, most of the cast is coming back for the anime, so. moving. No one drop health. Ah, 
Come on. No, no. Ah, uh, it was so close. Man, that's a tough game. Single player. But that is that hour. Hour is just gone. Really quick. And um, like we said, we might try and do this more in future, like maybe we find a good game that works well, like the Shredder's Revenge one. Maybe we'll do multiple sessions in a week of that one. Like I said, this is just a new idea we're trying, and we'll still do our other regular streams of other games, some retro games, different style of games. So just keep posted, you can find us. That's the the outro. Uh, you can find us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, and YouTube. All the links are in the description below. And big thank you to our Patreons, Twitch subscribers, and everyone else who's donated, you can sort of help support our channel on Patreon, Twitch subscriptions, bits, stickers, soundlets, and donations on Kofi. Really do appreciate it. Thank you very much, everyone, for joining us. Um, I never get this. The viewer count always seems lower. There's more people in the chat than what's viewing. So let's just do a panda raid. Anyway, let's see one, because then you can check someone else out as well while we're there. Let's see who is online. Alpha the wizard is asking if cereal is soup. Change my mind. Let's see if we can change Alpha the wizard's mind on cereal is soup. That's definitely interesting. Well, thank you very much, everyone. Join us. Um, we have a new YouTube video tomorrow that's a public video. So keep posted for that. Sorry, Alpha is talking my ear at the same time. <laughs> anyway, enjoy. Enjoy the rest of your evening, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Go and give a big panda hello to Alpha the Wizard. Doing some Lord Rings online, and he's saying that cereal is soup. <laughs>